Mason, Loveland, so many of mm -hmm. the different schools that are going to be at the bus stop for the first time this yes. morning. Congratulations. Welcome. Mm -hmm. Hey, first day of school picture is not going to be rained out, no. look gross. They're going to look good. Yes. I love seeing them with a when you can force your kid to hold a little sign that says, my teacher is this, I wanted to be that. Yeah. It's really cute. Um, tomorrow morning though, uh, first of all, congratulations if your first day of school is on a Friday, yeah, and that's a pretty great plan. <laughs> but we also are gonna have our first stormy morning at the bus stop tomorrow. So going through the next few days, the weekend is in sight. Today, expect a comfortable start. It does have that fallish feel this morning, but we're right back to 90 degrees this afternoon. Humidity stays down. As for Friday, we'll be starting the day with thunderstorms. Those storms roll in tonight after midnight. They'll be around for the morning rush, and you know what that always does. And then expect a humid day with a potential for an additional round of more scattered evening storms, but tomorrow a weather impact day into the weekend. There's a chance there could be some lingering showers, especially on Saturday, depending on how long that Friday system decides to hang out. As we look at the 12 hour forecast this morning, starting out with clear skies, our temperatures right now generally in the 60s, some spots low 60s, the further outside of the 275 loop you get. But you know what? By the time we get to about 9 a.m., we're back up to 70. Lunchtime closer to 80 and mid afternoon. Expect a high around 90 with low humidity. That muggy air will start to creep in later tonight and eventually the rain will arrive after midnight. You can see on the live radar right now, everything is quiet. There are a couple showers up north of Indy. Those will fall apart as they move our way. But for tomorrow, you can see all of greater Cincinnati in the green here, which is a marginal risk for some stronger storms, specifically uh, any storms that would be kind of isolated in the evening. So there was a chance that could impact some of your plans tomorrow night. Wanted to show you that here. So Futurecast fast forwarded to this evening when the clouds are moving in after midnight, rain and thunderstorms start to move in our direction. And I think by four or five o'clock, we've got pretty widespread rain and storms early tomorrow morning. They will be around as we get towards six and seven a.m. So may not be raining at all the bus stops in town or all the school districts, but uh, there'll be the, definitely the chance that we're dealing with some thunderstorms early. By the time we get to lunchtime, things will dry out. The sun will pop out and you guys know this summer scenario, right? That could juice up the atmosphere and then as scattered storms move in into the evening, those could potentially be stronger. So it'll be storms in the morning and kind of a wait and see forecast for Friday night. For today, though, 90 degrees, a sunny start, increasing clouds, still feeling pretty comfortable humidity wise. Tomorrow we have thunderstorms. Your, your Friday is a weather impact day, morning rain and thunder, a humid afternoon, and then kind of wait and see uh, with that potential for some scattered evening storms. Saturday, maybe a shower, especially in the morning. Temperatures will be in the mid 80s through the weekend. Megan? All right, Randy, thank you.